What's going on, everyone? Corey's Diecast Den coming at you again. Today, I have the latest batch of Kroger exclusive uh, Hot Wheels. Found them today at my local Kroger. We've got a custom 72 Chevy Love. The 95 Mazda RX-7. The P uh, Pagani Zonda R. Sorry. And the McLaren P1. So be on the lookout at your <clears throat> Kroger stores near you. And let's take a look at these guys. Starting out with the custom 72 Chevy Love. Alrighty, so I don't know very much about this truck in real life. Uh, I know it's definitely customized. Here, this casting, definitely lowered and probably lots of power. I think it's like a smaller truck, I'm not sure, like a compact truck, but <clears throat> like I said, I don't really know. But anyway, I've never been a huge fan of the casting, but I have to say I, I really like these wheels on just about everything they come on. And then I really like the paint job. Red's my favorite favorite color, but also you've got the black, like brown, I think. Some kind of green, and then like a cream color. Big stripe going down the side. And then on the hood, kind of got the same thing going. And a pretty detailed interior in there, chrome. And then chrome bed, Chevrolet, chrome on the front, got that big old engine. <clears throat> so this looks really good, I must say. I believe the last release of this in the main line was the screen one. I forget what case it came in, but it was earlier this year. So, it is different, obviously. Not as much... Well, I guess it does have the same kind of thing going on on the side, just different colors of green, or shades of green. Same wheels. Basically, uh, like most other exclusives, uh, it's basically just a recolor of a mainline release of the year. But I uh, enjoy finding exclusives, and I pretty much always find the Kroger ones almost immediately. They're much easier to find than uh, a lot of other things like Zamax or Red Editions. I can never find Red Editions anywhere. But up next is the 95 Mazda RX-7. This is the FD generation casting. Huge fan of this. Had tons of premium releases of this casting and quite a few main lines as well. And we've got it here in this uh, gray color shiny gray looks cool got black PR5 wheels with a uh, gold lip oh and you got tail lights as well cool very nice love this casting I believe they're, I forget what color is coming, is 
already out. I think it's blue, but I don't have that one yet. But I have this white one from earlier this year. Basically the same thing. Uh, different wheels. And different color, obviously. But same uh, decos, essentially. Very cool. I believe the other one's blue. I could be wrong. But this looks really good. I like the PR5s. And the gold lip around it. That blue looks really good up against the nice granity gray. Looks awesome. Huge fan of this casting. I have so many versions of this. I uh, pretty much buy it just about any time it comes out. And I've really de been debating on purchasing the RLC version, which I know a lot of people weren't super impressed by, but I don't know. But I really want it, but it's hard to justify those RLC cars. They're so expensive, especially if you get them on eBay or something. But yeah. Very cool casting. Love this car. Alright. Up next, we'll look at the Pagani Zonda R. In green now. We got this model uh, in 2022. And it's had maybe five mainline releases up till now. And also, I think just one premium version. And that was... Uh, I can't remember. Has there been a premium version? I'm having a brain fart. But anyway... Black uh, lace style wheels, the newer kind, not the uh, really old ones. Got the Zonda R badge at the uh, bottom. Some good detail on the exhaust and on the back, even though there's no lights. Very, very cool. Shiny green color. It says Pagani on top of the wing. Very detailed model overall. The casting itself has a lot of detail in it. The molding. I think this looks really cool. Very exotic. How it should be. And I believe this yellow one here was the last regular mainline release of it that we got this year. Same uh, black lace wheels. Uh, just different color. I think uh, the color itself is the only difference. But, <clears throat> huge Pagani fan. And uh, I was really excited when they came out with this casting. Very cool car. But yeah, this looks uh this looks awesome. It's gonna be I feel like this or the RX seven might be my favorites, but we'll see after I open up the McLaren. But yeah, Pagani's on to R. Very nice. And lastly The McLaren P1 in purple with the gray lace style wheels, same as the Pagani, just in gray. And I believe there's already been a purple mainline version of the McLaren P1, but different wheels and 
that might be the only difference. It looks like the same color, just about, but this car has had so many mainline releases. Like in my collection, I I don't even have all of them, but I probably have I don't know, over ten, maybe even close to fifteen <laughs> uh mainline versions of this car. And I believe it's only had one premium release. I think, and that was all the way back in uh, like 2017 in the Cars and Donuts car culture set. I could be wrong, but I believe that's the only time we've gotten a premium. But I like this casting a lot. Awesome car in real life. Super sweet. Super fast. Uh, if you know me at all, I don't like larger rear wheels, but... I don't know. I don't think it looks bad on this car. And it's just a mean, aggressive looking car in general. It has like 900 horsepower. It's a hybrid V8 turbo. Very fast car. Always gets taillights, no matter what. I feel like uh, every release has had taillights and headlights, and then just a uh, solid color, usually with that black piece of plastic in there. And uh, this blue one here was from earlier this year in the main line. Sorry, they're both wanting to roll off now. There we go black lace wheels instead of gray on the uh, Kroger exclusive. And uh, it's kind of a sky blue color. I like it a lot. The more the merrier with this casting. I have so many of them, like I said. And uh, I don't know. They both look good. But yeah, that is the McLaren P1, and that is your latest 2024 Hot Wheels Kroger exclusive mix. Pretty nice mix, if you ask me. Whoops, we'll make it work. There we go. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. This is Corey's Diecast In. I hope you all have a good night, good rest of your weekend. You'll be hearing from me soon. Take care.